Amanil Kumar and here is a test practice question for you relating greatest common factor and least common multiple. Find two set of possible numbers whose greatest common factor is 5 and least common multiple is 60. So what we are given here is that the greatest common factor is 5 and least common multiple is 60 you need to find set of two possible numbers. You can pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. Now when we are given greatest common factor and least common multiple between two numbers, we can look into their factors. Let us say the circle represents factors of one of the numbers and the other circle represents factors of the other number. Now what we are given here is that common factors between them is 5. So that is the common factor. When we say least common multiple is 60, we mean when we multiply all these numbers, we get 60. Now to get 60 from 5, we know 5 times 12 is 60, right? or 60 divided by 5 gives you 12. So that means 12 could be a factor of the other number, right? So we could write 12 here. So that gives us one set of numbers. Now this set of numbers is what? 5, that means no other factor here except for 1. So this number should be 5 and the other number should be 5 times 12, 60. As I said earlier, always set 1 is the set of numbers which includes the greatest common factor and the least. So 5 and 60 is definitely one of the sets, right? So that is one of our solutions. So let me highlight this for you. Now the question is to find the second set. How to find the second set? Let's redo this question. So we have one set here, the other set, and we know that the greatest common factor is 5. Now we know 12, when multiplied by 5, will give us 60. We can write 12 as 4 times 3 also. Now here also, what is the greatest common factor? It is 5. And what is least common multiple? Let's multiply three of them, which is equals to 4 times 5 times 3. 4 times 5 is 20, times 3 is 60, right? So we get both the conditions. So what are the numbers? We can now write down our numbers. The numbers are 5 times 4 is the first number, which is 20. 5 times 3 is the second number, which is 15. So we get our second set. Second set has two numbers, which are 20 and 15. So these are possible solutions, correct? So that is our second set. I hope with this you understand how to find different set of numbers when we are given least common multiple and greatest common fact. I hope you find it interesting. I'm Anil Kumar. You can subscribe to my videos and learn a lot about these things. Thank you and all the best.